109 beautiful big grill i mean look at the detail this is the maserati key how it's filtered What's up guys and welcome back to a new windy inside series of this beautiful Maserati Levante S Q4 Grand Sport. Yeah you probably can't hear me but this is the cold start of the Levante S and this baby is producing 430 horses. So yeah as you might already know Maserati has gone as you freestyle now. And uh, since they're producing the Levante, it's their biggest production numbers of the whole model range. I have the option list of this specific Levante S over here with all the prices. So we're going to have a look at all these options. Then we're going to do a full exterior walk, interior walk, and of course the rev shots of this Ferrari developed V6 by turbo engine. First of all, Maserati Levante S Q4 Grand Sport. That's the full name of this Levante. Yeah, it's a mouthful, it's a mouthful. Color Grigio Maratea. And the letters, leather black gray. Power numbers 430 horses. 580 Newton meters between 2000 and 4750 RPM. From 0 to 100 kilometers an hour in 5.2 seconds. And a top speed of 264 kilometers an hour. Base price of this model in the Netherlands 170,000, 110 euros. So we have some base options: 20-inch Nero satin wheels with the 8.4-inch touchscreen with set nav and DAB, with a dual cast brake system, 280 millimeters and 330 millimeters in front and the rear. Steering wheel, electronic adjustable, Inox pedals shift pedals, soft closing doors, sport rear spoiler in the color of the paint, sport steering wheel, sport seats and steel door handles. Okay, let's highlight a few specific options of this Levante SQ4 Grand Sport. Beautiful 21 inch staggered Helios satin wheels, panoramic sunroof with a special paint, double layered and tinted windows in the back, with a chrome finish in the rear trunk, of a hardened garden premium sound system with 14 speakers in the interior we have a metal net high gloss finishing that's 2178 euros premium leather with the trident stitched in the headrests nice seats extra perforated premium leather safety and technology driver assistant package almost 4000 euros you have an anti-theft system easy access pack and we have yellow calipers giving this Maserati Levante S Q4 Grand Sport in the Netherlands a total end price including these crazy taxes 190,680 euros check okay let's start on the exterior Levante S Q4 Grand Sport let's start on that front first of all the trident is in your face with that front camera and that huge grille that's for a Grand Sport designed in this way with the gloss black finishing of these pillars <laughs> very nice some chrome finishing here in the grille so yeah definitely beautiful big grille this is an Italian press car that's why it's an Italian plated car here below that front splitter also in gloss with some nice finishing here in the lower grille in front of the radiator Okay, the headlights so yeah we have a really wide headlight really small and aggressive here you have the day driving lights the LEDs there we have by xenon this one doesn't have the full option of the LEDs here on the side we have Maserati in the headlight really nice to see the brand of the car in the headlights Fog lights, I my guesses. I hope this is LED. Ah, there, intercoolers on the left with an intake, and over here on the side, an air channel. Really, really nice looking front nose. Ok, 
Okay, let's have a look at those staggered wheels. Look at what a design this is. I mean, look at the detail. So we have a silver finish, we have a gray finish. Also the, on the trim on the outside. And these little points here. If you're asking me, this is one of the most beautiful wheels I've recently saw on all the cars I have filmed. So there in the back, Maserati printed yellow calipers, looking like six pistons, 380 millimeters. Wheel measures of 265, 40, 21 inch. There you can see the air suspension and the dirt from off-roading. So yeah, you can clearly see the chrome finishing in the windows also there on the side with the ground support and the door handles privacy glass in the rear and the beautiful coupe line of the SUV here on the side the beautiful trident and not to forget the spoiler for the ground support in the paint of the car Okay, let's have a look at the rear wheels. Measures 295, 35, 21 inch, 330 millimeters discs. Okay, the rear section. These are the LED lights of the Levante. And then here below for the Grand Sport, this specific diffuser with four exhaust pipes. Producing a beautiful V6 sound, you will hear it later on. Four park pilots in the rear. The rear camera, chrome finish and the Maserati logo in the rear. Really nice gloss finish here in the window. Little details, little details. You can also see how nice the shape of the rear LED shapes all the way in the rear bumper. Those are small details, but very important. Okay, exterior check. It's time to pop the hood and the trunk. And let's see the beautiful Ferrari developed built engine and the big truck space. This is the Maserati key, quite big. Really nice, and here you have a little button to open the trunk. Proper, proper trunk. This is my jacket and my camera bag, so you can compare it with all the other trunk spaces. It's a proper trunk space, and the buttons to close the trunk are over here instead of here where it's uh, actually everywhere almost in every car but in the Levante you have them over here see that Ferrari build engine there V6 by turbo Ferrari developed 430 horses. You can clearly see here the intakes, the left and the right air boxes. The air getting filtered there, entering the V6 chambers.
hood check, trunk check. It's time to get inside and let's have a look at the interior of the Levante S. Start at the doors. First of all, you can see we're talking about a coupe. This is the proof. Only the window trims. And you can see the double layered gloss. So, black leather with that gray stitching. And you can see here some special carbon trims. Satin metal finishes. Memory seats. The hardened carbon audio system. And this is all leather, also here below leather, here also leather. And the metal door finish for the door sills. The memory seats and these are the sport seats. With that Maserati Trident in the headrest. Okay, the entrance test. The car is on the regular air suspension height. So, this is super easy, super easy entrance. Okay, let's close this heavy door. Welcome inside. When driving, this is your point of view in this Levante SQ4. Black is everywhere, including that carbon view. Okay, let's start on the side. So on the left, we have the start and stop button of the car. And the light switch, you can see that we have full automatic lights. And on top you have a little vent with a metal finish. And on the dash, this is all leather with that gray stitching. And I don't know if you can't see it, if you can see it, but this looks like Alcantara, you normally would expect. But this is something else, it's a, it's a wall kind of type. It looks nice, it looks really nice. So in the center here, a nice big speaker unit and the exclusive Maserati clock in the center of the dash. The right side again, that, that leather with the gray stitching. Now you can clearly see how the dash is designed towards the center really symmetric steering wheel so this is the sport steering wheel as you saw on the option list here on the left you have the buttons for your automatic cruise control here on the right for your center menu and this is by the way all leather these are the speedometers of the Maserati just like in the Ghibli shift down shift up a really nice Italian big shift pedal style okay the center console so this is the set nav system of maserati with a touch screen below the set nav we have here the controls for the climate system here we have the temperature for the driver right for the passenger so two zone controlled here you can see that finish of this special carbon fiber. There is a little space including aux, USB and a memory card slot. Here we have two cup holders. And for the 2019 model, the new gear knob just like in the Ghibli with that nice trident again the button controls most fun button the sport button and the suspension button increasing the suspension of the car and this opens the exhaust valve this is also a nice feature I personally think a two button combination on top of each other volume and the controls for the set nav 
control for the air suspension and here in this big armrest whoa that's deep holy moly <laughs> so we have here also 180 watt max 12 volt input and uh, yeah you can uh, store here oh actually maybe some champagne nice Here we have some controls for some light switches and the controls for the panoramic roof. Let's close this. Also here you have the button to open the rear trunk or to close it. Front cabin, check. It's time to get over here in those rear seats. And trust me, it's big over there. Okay, the rear section, privacy glass, clear to see compared to the front windows. Here you can see how it's filtered, bluish filter and also double layered glass for some extra isolation and no metal trim, glass only. Okay, the rear doors, identical as the front doors, but then a bit smaller, again that nice carbon trim, metal set and finish, the grey stitching. All leather, the Harman Kardon audio system also here. The Maserati finished door sill and those big rear seats. So the cool thing on SUV life is this, your entrance is always super comfortable. This is your point of view of your passenger over here. Also in this headrest, a Trident. We have a little LED, a window, some little vents. What's this? Hey, nice. This is what we like. We like to charge our phones. So again, a 12 volt input and two USB inputs. Just to remind you, charge only. And here you can clearly see how nice those seats are designed with that leather. Sport seats. You can see how big this total is. Also here, a little armrest, two cup holders. And the coupe line in the whole interior. So yeah, the Levante S Q4 Grand Sport, all right. Exterior check, interior check, optional list check. It's time to give you guys some proper sounds of this V6 by turbo engine. I hope she's gonna give us a cold start because the cold start of this car is so, so, so nice. And after the start and the rest, I'm gonna put the GoPro on the exhaust because you definitely need to hear how this car sounds while driving under pressure when the boost goes to the upper level and the turbo scroll up because this is so, so unique. I love this V6. Personally, this V6 by turbo engine is one of the best sounding V6 engines of this age. I already said it in the Ghibli video, but I'm gonna say it again, but even in this engine, it produces more horsepower. So that means better sound. <laughs> Mmm. -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
for watching this Insta series of the Levante S Q4 Grand Sport. If you need any info, check out my links below for my socials. Ciao!